morning students and welcome you again to another online class of Manvesha School. You know me as your English literature teacher but today I am here to take another chapter of moral science. We have already completed chapter 3 till chapter 3 and today I will start a new chapter of moral science that is chapter 4. Let's see what is in that chapter and uh, I'll explain you the chapter as I'll go through the, the reading of that chapter. So get ready with your book. Chapter 4 is the miser and his gold. Miser means you know uh, conjures who don't want to uh, spend his money. Okay. When what is the value that is taught in this chapter? Not being selfish. Selfish means when you only think about yourself and you don't care for anyone around you. Let's see. The lesson is designed to teach the children not to be selfish. Selfishness is a very bad habit. Such children never learn to share anything and hence can never make friends. It is important for children to be selfless otherwise they will only lead a lonely and miserable life. This means that children should not be selfish. If you are selfish that means you are only thinking about yourself and you will not going to have any friends in your life. Okay. So this type of uh, and if you don't have any friends that means you, are, you have to lead a very lonely and miserable life. So you should be selfless now understanding the value selflessness selfishness means thinking only about oneself a selfish person is concerned only about his happiness so if a person is selfish he will only think about himself only my my and mine he never thinks about other people such a person considers only himself important okay he must get the best of things whether others get those things or not. So if a person is selfish, he will only think of himself and he will only want to have things for himself. Uh, he gets his desires fulfilled at any cost without bothering about others whether they suffer, live or die. A selfish person is neither sincere nor loyal all people avoid such a person such a person never has friends as he is unkind and greedy okay greedy means lalaj so if a person is selfish and if he only thinks about himself definitely no one will like those type of person and no one wants to be friend of those type of person selfish people lead a miserable life selfishness is a bad quality it only brings sadness and misery. A selfish person has to face a lot of problems. Hence, it is important to be selfless. Okay, so it is important to be selfless, not to be selfish. Selfless people are kind and generous. They first think of others. They help others. Such people lead a happy life. So if you are selfless, People will love you. People will want to be, uh, will want to be your friend. And as a person, you will be happy, and your life will also lead a happy life. Okay, such person leads a happy life. Now, as you know, a small story is also mentioned here. In this story, we will see that when a person becomes selfish, what happens to his life, or what happens in his life? Let's see. There lived a man in a small town. He was rich but also very selfish. He never helped the needy. Needy means those who want help. So a, a, a person lived in a small town and the person is very rich. But at the same time he was very selfish. He don't want to help anyone in his uh, when the person needs help. He didn't even look after his wife and children well. So as a person, he is so much selfish that he didn't even care to take care uh, of his wife and children. He was a miser. Miser means conjures. He had sold whatever he had and turned his money into a bar of gold. 
Now that means what? Whatever he had, he sold everything, and then whatever money he got, he had. He uh, whatever money he got, he turned his money into a bar of gold. Okay. The miser then hid the gold bar in a hole in the garden, and when he turned all his money into a bar of gold. The miser then hid the gold bar in a hole in his garden. Okay, so what the miser, what the person did, he had uh, whatever money he had, he just uh, changed that into a bar of gold, and then he hid that bar of gold in his garden. He dig a hole, and then he put everything in that hole. after this what happens to the person or what happens to his bar of gold that we will see in the next video till then you reach chapter 4 thank you